Blood and Guts made Dynamite Cable's number one show on Wednesday. Now, don't miss the aftermath. John Moxley defends the AEW Interim World Championship against Royal Rampage winner Brody King. And Wardlow challenges TNT champion Scorpio Sky. Let's make it a street fight. AEW Wednesday Night Dynamite, live tonight at 8 on TBS. It's Wednesday night, time to ignite the dynamite from Rochester, New York. I'm Alex, she's Dasha, and Dasha, tonight we've got not one, but two championship two. matches, and we've got two sensational tag team matches that are going to be taking place tonight on Dynamite, so let's get to it. Let's get to let's it. First talking about uh, our first competitors who are not too far from Rochester. I'm talking about the Butcher and the Blade from Buffalo. Yep. They're going to be taking on Swerve in Our Glory, Keith Lee, Swerve Strickland, two guys who aren't necessarily they've on the same of, page. Yeah, they've been kind of in on odd ends. But you know what the thing is, though? They've been victorious the last they few have. times that they teamed together. They've, they've had their issues, but they have a common ground. The two men that always are on the same page are Butcher Blade. Mm -hmm. And don't forget, added to that equation, you had a little bunny in there. Oh, yeah. And the bunny likes money. And that's exactly what the Butcher and Blade are looking to do. They're looking to take the winner's share of the purse here tonight on Dynamite. But we also have another tag team match that right. kind of Mother Nature put this team together. I'm talking about Team Thunderstorm, our AEW Women's World Champion, Thunder Rosa and Tony Storm coming together to take on common foes in the native problem? The problem beast? Either one, we'll have to ask them. Yeah, Either way, yeah. it's Nyla Rose and Marina Shafir, two women who, well, quite frankly, were like made to be friends. Yeah, totally. But the thing is though, we've heard from Tony Storm and we know what she's after. She's after the AEW Women's World Championship, but at the same time, these two women are very intelligent. They are going to use their strengths to dominate the women's division, as they say. But the thing is, though, Marina is another woman who is a problem, who's always getting in there, who really has stood out. So will the Native Beast and the problem be on the same page tonight? Or will the Thunderstorm come out with a victory? Well, we'll see. We'll have to get the weather forecast and, uh, and see who's going to take this matchup. Well, let's talk about a man that I think nobody really likes, Christian Cage. We're going to be hearing from him and this really sinister version of Luchasaurus here yeah, tonight. Yeah. I would say that a handful of people like Christian Cage post change in attitude. But you know what? To each their own. Everyone can have their own opinion. Now, Luchasaurus, he, he's definitely had a change in attitude. We saw what he did to Serpentico last week. Serpentico, sure I hope you're healing up. I hope you're doing okay. He's used to taking abuse. He is. But the thing is, though, nobody should ever, nobody deserves that. Very good point. Defending the TNT Championship here tonight, Scorpio Sky, because he's got to take on Mr. Mayhem Wardlow in a street fight. Most people would say that it's kind of a bit of a handicap match because we know Scorpio Sky doesn't come alone. He's got the other half of the men of the year in all ego Ethan Page, but at the same time, Dan Lambert. Sometimes they bring in American Top Team goons, whatever you want to call them. But the thing is, though, Mr. Mayhem has defeated 20 men at one time. Yeah, it's insane <laughs> what Wardlow is capable of doing. Yeah. Wardlow is more focused, more determined than ever. Mr. Mayhem, I think, is going to be on a tear here That's tonight. Right. But you're right, men of the year, you yeah. never know when American Top Team is around. We know Dan Lambert is a master yeah. strategist. And it's a street fight. And it's a street fight. Which is Wardlow's specialty. We are living in Wardlow's world. Well, we'll <laughs> see if Mr. Mayhem can become TNT champion here tonight. Now, let's talk about the interim AEW World right. Champion, John Moxley. He's defending that championship for the first time tonight against the winner yep. of the Royal Rampage, which took place this past Friday night on Rampage from the House of Black, Brody King. Brody King, now speaking of Brody, we are in the home of the late, great Mr. Brody Lee. But will we have a Brody, as in King, as the new interim champion? Uh, listen, I certainly hope not. I hope that John Moxley wipes the floor. You know how I feel about the House of Black. <laughs> They're calculating. They're evil. Yeah. They're going to do everything possible to take this championship. I think John Moxley really Alex, needs Alex, to be Alex, prepared tonight. I know tonight. you're really, really excited about this. I know how passionate you are. I am. I'm supposed to have an unbiased opinion here. I am unbiased. I hope John Moxley beats them two ways till Sunday. I'm with you too, John Moxley. We're rooting for you, and we hope you wipe the floor clean. But That's the thing right. is, though, the House of Black. House of Black isn't necessarily in one place. It's kind of everywhere. And we know Julia Hart, she's had her change in attitude. She's really changed a lot. And she may just cause some mischief, but the same we can say about Malachi Black. So 
May the odds be ever in your favor, John Moxley. Hopefully the Blackpool Combat Club may come to the aid. Not that you need it at all. Not at all. Not well, at all. it'd be great to have them there in case House of Black does decide to stick their nose where it doesn't belong. But either way, it's going to be a sensational matchup, a very even matchup, I think, tonight for the Interim World Championship. Tasha, where can we see this here tonight? We can see you all tonight at 8, 7 Central on TBS. But Alex, guess what? Good news. I have my own mic. Congratulations. Thank you. Yeah, that and apparently you've joined Jade and the Baddies. Listen, 